This is one of those cases that is extremely bizarre. What's up guys, my name's Harmon. Uh, so July 22nd, 2010, 43 year old Michael Anderson and his girlfriend, 23 year old Paige Miller, uh, were both found dead right in front of Omaha's Henry Doily Zoo. Their bodies were found about 30 yards from the main entrance. Uh, but before I continue, I am surrounded by monarch butterflies. So Paige Miller was 23 and Michael Anderson was 43. Michael had a kid that lived in Iowa, I believe. And Paige, even though she was only 23, she already had three kids. I don't know for sure if all those kids were living with her at the time. It sounded like it was just her and Michael living at their house. Hours before uh, they were killed, Paige had talked to her cousin on the phone and uh, was just saying that they were just kind of hanging around the house that day. So nothing really out of the ordinary. She didn't mention anything, you know, that sounded suspicious or weird or anything like that. That was kind of the last contact she had was with her cousin a couple hours before their bodies were found. And the fact that their bodies were presumably killed somewhere else and then dumped here, or maybe they were killed here and dumped here. But regardless, very bizarre case. Um, apparently they both had some trouble with the law before. So Michael Anderson was uh, arrested for drug possession. He spent about 180 days in jail and then he was in prison for two years just before he was killed for a second or third degree assault on an officer. And uh, Paige apparently had some issues as well with the law. Regardless of what he did and what Paige did, their deaths um, was still a tragic thing and especially because it's unsolved. The workers that found them, they went up the street to kind of flag down an officer. They closed down the main entrance here temporarily that day, as you would imagine, because they didn't want park goers to be anywhere near that, uh, that scene. As I mentioned, uh, both Michael and Paige, they're, they were found basically said, said 30 yards from the main entrance. So it's about 90 feet um, from the main entrance. As of this year, 2020, their cases have not been solved. So if you guys have any random tips or uh, suggestions or opinions leave them in the comments down below also if you have any credible information obviously the Omaha Police Department would love to hear what you have to say I think the last uh, thing I read said they're giving a $25,000 reward for any information so if you have any uh, 
any legit information, please give them a call. I always dislike some of these unsolved cases for the mere fact that they're unsolved. It really, it bothers me. It's because two families, the families of Michael Anderson and the families of Paige Miller, they deserve to know what happened. I have lots of other infamous places, infamous people, infamous crimes. That's what this channel is all about. So if you're new around here and you enjoy that kind of content, definitely subscribe. Hit the little bell button next to it. And as always, my name's Harmon. I appreciate you all watching. And until next time, I'll see you guys on the next case.